Hey Fit Fam, and welcome back to my Fit Tip series. This is Fit Tip number 27, and it is stop eating added sugars. Added sugar is probably the worst thing that you can do for weight loss and for health. And in general, you really want to cut back on sugar, any type of sugar. But there are two types of sugar. There's your natural sugars that you find in fruit, and then there's your sugars that you find in candy bars and in spaghetti sauce and in all kinds of different things you'll find at the store or restaurants. So those are the sugars, the ones that don't naturally occur in food that you want to completely eliminate from your diet. Now of course from time to time it's fine to have. It's not going to kill you if you have it, you know, a couple times a month you want to splurge on a dessert or something like that. Totally understandable. But for the most part, you do want to get it just completely out of your diet. Um, and instead, if you are going to have an added sugar, it should be a natural one like honey or pure maple syrup, but none of the white refined stuff, none of the even like brown sugars, raw sugars, things like that. Just cut those out completely. Even if it's organic cane sugar, things like that really any added sugar you want to stay away from because sugar is what basically is going to spike your insulin and that's what ultimately leads to weight gain and it just has so many other adverse effects on your health and probably the thing I hear the most from clients the the one commonality that people say I took this out of my diet and it totally changed my weight it was the easiest way to lose weight or it changed how I felt it's always cutting out sugar that people, if they do any kind of like detox or try an elimination diet and take out sugar, that one always has a huge impact on people. You will feel better, you will look healthier, you'll have better energy, and you will definitely lose weight if you cut out sugar. Like I said earlier, even in things like spaghetti sauce, that's the hard part with sugar is it can be hidden in everything. So it's gonna be in things like spaghetti sauce and ketchup and sauces, dressings, all kinds of things that you might top your food with or find at a restaurant. You'll find it, of course, in things like pastries or candy, protein bars, even protein bars you're gonna find a lot of it, barbecue sauce, condiments, drinks, juice, uh, alcoholic beverages, like mixed drinks. I'll put a list below, and I'll also write a blog on this on my website. I'll put a much more full list of all the places where sugars tend to hide out both the kind of obvious ones, but also the ones you might not think about so much. So be sure to check that. For more examples of the type of foods that you want to stay away from, uh, you might be surprised. So if you do want to keep things sweet, you have a sweet tooth like I do, then opt for things like stevia and monk fruit to add that sweet flavor to your food. Those are natural sweeteners that are not chemically made like aspartame. Uh, or sucralose, so stay away from those too. And I'm, when I talk about cutting out added sugars, you should also be cutting out um, fake sweeteners, artificial sweeteners. Those things are horrible for you. You're just putting chemicals into your body that are gonna do a lot of harm. So if you're gonna add sugar, you wanna do some baking, something like that, up for stevia or up for monk fruit. Those are the most natural options for you. And try to find organic if at all possible. Definitely implement this one this year. If you only pick a few of these fit tips to do to help you get in better shape, this would be probably number one or definitely within the top five. So start doing that a little bit at a time. You don't have to completely eliminate it all at once, but at least start trying to cut back uh, here and there, make some better choices until it becomes a lot easier. And the good news is those cravings will fade. Once you kick sugar, your body doesn't crave it as much anymore and you really won't miss it that much. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next Fit Tip video.